Mr. Coffee Rat. Thank you. Ready? Go! It's gonna be fun, I think. Ah! Uh, no, it won't, because if my cloud counter picks up the drain line, we're gonna see Peach buff. Yeah. And uh, that that won't be fun. Wake up, Jeff. Huh? It's a good one. I'm nice. gonna get a female named Jeffs in this very soon. He spelled it wrong. You got the double letter in the wrong yeah, spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What an idiot. Oh, fucking what a amateur. fucking <laughs> chump, Black. <laughs> time him out. Time you him fucking out. chump. You're gonna be timed out for that. <laughs> oh my god. Hello, hello. <laughs> Oh, he's gone. Alright, oh, look, like, look at Goody. Another, another fucking chump. <laughs> Guys, you no, got... Leave him, leave him, leave him. Leave, go leave Goody? Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay. I'm really keen to see this. this oh, I, I appreciate that one. Jeef. Jeef. Yeah. Jeep with an F. Oh. Nobody can get it right, man. Two J's, one F. This is White, presumably? Yeah. I don't think it's a moth white option. Eh, well, he'll just be moth. But... Sorry, everyone. It's okay. It's actually good on some teeth. Alright, we're into it. Two J's, one F. Yep. Gyofja. This is really on topic. <laughs> Honestly, I prefer the kind of like uh, just shit talking casting instead of just shout casting everything that's happened. Like just an occasional, oh, this cool thing happened, or a reaction. Because uh, people know know what's going on. They sure do. They know that uh, the fly has been sliced and he has been diced. Yeah. All right. Well. And now he's gonna turn up on the edge guard. Oh. Looks, looks good. Oh no. Yeah, just down smash. I feel like uh, Peach players get like a hit to their dopamine receptors every time they get to touch their C stick down. Oh, it's, it's true. And McLeod's got a nice single button. Never any, never any ambiguity. Yeah. No chance oh. of hitting a side or an up. Just a C stick down. Yeah. He's got it. That was a, like a forty-second edge guard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was on the ropes for a while there. So much peach action here. I really want to see Nick pull out the puff just to make McLeod's life oh. actual hell. It would be so much fun. His puff is way better than mine. The thing is, I think, uh, and I'm not the first to point this out, I think McLeod is one of the few people who enjoys an eight minute grind. Oh, so do I, man. I love it. Oh. I think uh, it's super interactive, and whoever like gets mad first, like they run out of steam game two, they're fucked. <laughs> Like, you can't do that shit for more than one game in a row, like most people. I, I can tell you're from yeah. South Australia. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just a puff player, man. I love yeah. it. I think, like, uh, don't hate the player, I hate the game. And uh, it's just a fun Dude, way to play. The cloud is looking brutal. Yeah. Nick, Nick not looking pleased. In the player count. I've seen him on a stream. He gets angry when he wins. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh... I find it interesting how much harder oh, your box a... is. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like, McLeod was playing up there. They're actually both my boxes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, his has Sam was, and I think that's Silent Sam was, whereas mine has optimal switches. Yeah. I wish uh, you could put, like, Cherry MX Blues in there or something. Shit. You can. Like, really? Really? Yeah. Oh, my God, that'd be so fucking loud. I saw some dude make a ceramic keycap for his keyboard, and that was really <laughs> cool. It just sounded like he was, like... Like tapping his fing like fingernails on a on a vase. It was awesome. Nice, actually. Yeah. I'd kind of like that. I uh, mean, suck if you dropped it. Or oh, absolutely. Had to remove the keycap somehow. It was really heavy keyboard to. Right. Yeah. I mean, you're not gonna move your keyboard. I move my keyboard pretty often. You, you push it. I push it. And that's it. I turn it a little. I yeah, get, but like, you don't even pick it up. It's fine. I pick it up sometimes. That's weird. You're weird. Yeah, I've got a small keyboard though. I've got a 60% keyboard, so I take ah, it around okay. with me. I take it to the library. Really? Bring my laptop. Yeah, because uh. it's like super fucking loud and fun to type on. <laughs> so I like sit in one of the stores here. Nice. Oh, the cloud's actually looking really good. This can just... This stock I think is going to go... Oh, no, he gets no. full. That sucks. And tip F smash. This is like where the tilt starts to set in. You start gripping your box really hard. Apparently the top half of McLeod's... You mean he has curly hair, Yoshling? 
the cloud's head looks like I beats. It kind of does. Like with the fringe, it looks a little bit there. IBDW has a very like uh, rectangular head. It's not shade. I have a very square head. Uh, oh man, they stuck his last ages. Great for McLeod, but Nick just won't fucking die. Yeah, he's got like Peach Ritus. <laughs> he has Marth Ritus. Just some arthritic gamers here. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, as far as I know, that's what happens if you're playing a controller long enough. Yeah. I like, uh, there's this new Not game. you, you play Puff. I play Puff, yeah. <laughs> no, it's seriously, like, I I didn't know I was, like, playing the game weird for a really long time. Like, most people just, like, tap their... Yeah, Puff is weird. Yeah, Puff is really weird. People, like, bag on her a lot, but she doesn't play normal. Finally, he's fucking dead. Holy moly. Uh, I've got, like, a dent near my X button, because, like, I just, like, flick my fingernail, like, off it, and there's a huge dent in my controller. Oh, now. that's how I used to shot Hop as well. Yeah. Let's yeah. do it. All right, game first to Nick, 20%. I kind of want Cloud to take it. it. I want Nick to go puff <laughs> so bad. He will. If he goes Dream One, he will. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I mean, so he'll the do it is, anyway. Cloud knows, right? So the question is, he's he's either picking puff on, like he's choosing to play Nick's puff on Dream Land, or he's choosing to play the Moth uh, the elsewhere. Yeah. Yes! Woo! He's Let's go! Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So excited. Uh, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna browse Twitter for eight minutes. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna take so fucking long. I know uh, McLeod doesn't hate this matchup, though. I played it against him a bunch and he kicked my ass there, but it's like, who can be more patient and like never land on top of people? No, 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 genuinely, he, he will he will enjoy this if it's yeah. an eight minute grind. I love, I really like this too. I just hate playing it in friendlies. Because, uh. Right, yeah, because you don't. People, it just makes people mad. Like, but also, you're not putting the pressure on for a reason, right? Yeah. In a tournament, you're there to grind them out. You want them exhausted. Exactly. You want people to play as bad as possible. Like, half of it's mental. I'm not going to Phantom, by the way. I have, uh, extracurricular responsibilities, so. But hopefully, uh, sometime in the next 10 years, I'll be able to attend something outside of SA. That I, yeah, McLeod really likes this matchup. Man. It is fun. If both people are like committed to the grind, then it is really fun to just like get stale back airs. Stitch does so much because she gets the full so much. Yeah. I uh, what? Look at that phantom here. You see that? I did not. I was too busy <laughs> not looking at the beach pop on Dreamline. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're browsing. The only part of that screen I'm looking at is the timer. It's like on r slash fuck cars or something. <laughs> Oh, leaving angry <laughs> comments. You know what? <laughs> yeah, you're actually pulling out your phone. No, yeah, I'm, I'm just going to Twitter. <laughs> Alright. Well, this is fun for me to watch. We're almost, we're a minute and a half in and the first one hasn't been taken, but here's like a decided lead. Update. Oh, you're right. Uh, get one to Nick. Where's Kai? I just want to thumbs him up. He's nowhere. He's gone. Man, if people wanted to get food after this, they're going to be waiting a while. Oh, no, I'm going home, man. I'm yeah, fucking I'm tired. I'm just going to get Maccas and hop on the train. I'm getting gimped, glamped in my favorite game. Oh, man. This is huge for Nick. This is actually fun to play. And character icons, you're right. Thanks, Kai. Thank you. This might time out. I really think it will because both we have some patient I, gamers here. Well, I mean, I, I hate to break it to you, but eight divided by four is two, and they have gone well more than two minutes <laughs> yeah. before anyone lost the stuff. Well, I mean, if you run out of patience, you will. Uh, Why did Kai? <laughs> you will die much sooner. Oh. oh my god! See, like Peach, actually, you. It's such a fun matchup to play, in my opinion. Like, Peach players will complain about it endlessly, because it is bad for Peach. But it's like, who can lay him harder? And, uh, that's what Melee's all about. Look, Enlightenment man. is realizing every character's lame. There's nothing I, you can do about it. I played McLeod with my fledgling cheek recently, and he described me as, he's never seen someone whose game plan is to make their opponent as bored as possible. <laughs> and he wasn't wrong. Yeah. Look. I would, I would, I would full hop charge needles, and then he came in, I would shoot them, and eventually he would try and pull a turn up in anger, and I would just throw a full pack of needles at him when we were <laughs> and he would just get bored and do something dumb, and then I would run in and grab him. It was yeah, great. Yeah, fun. Look at the viewer count just drop. He's gonna go down so hard. 
And if he put more effort into that, if they're not getting bored, uh, he may be doing better here. Yeah. I mean, I don't think he's bored. I think he's enthused. I, I think the tension, like, stops you being bored, but it does eventually get yeah. you. Yeah. Two stocks have been taken, and we're halfway through the timer. Four minutes. Jesus. Oh. That's really smart. You can cover Got a lot him. of those platforms with Peach, and it hits so hard. This is grand finals. You're right. <laughs> God damn, dude. I suck at this. I just hopped on. Ah. Yeah, I just looked around, and everyone kind of gave me like little shakes on the head. <laughs> and Jin uh, Jeff eagerly walked over. Oh my god, he's that's so huge. Because that's like is hard, 19. Correct. That's like 19 neutral interactions, 51%. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. that's an enormous lead. I think my cloud's liking this. Yeah, I think that the problem is, like, on some level, like, emotionally, this is a gamble on Nick's part, too, because if he loses, he's the one who feels like shit. Yeah, it, uh, this is an embarrassing matchup to lose, because you never get to play it as a buff player, and if you lose, you're like, fuck, man, people tell me this matchup is so bad, and I just got my ass kicked. <laughs> but it's also that he chose this eight-minute match, and if yeah. he loses it, it's like, well... We just lost almost 100 viewers. Did we really? Yeah, that's where's, bad. where's the view? Like 82, we're at 364. Oh shit, okay. What Peach Puff you, does. You did this, <laughs> guys. You did this. I mean, I'm liking this. This is fun for me. It's actually not bad to watch. I'm gonna be yeah. real. Like, the tension of just watching their very slowly incrementing damage versus the clock is kind of fun for me. Yeah. There's a lot going on uh, that most people don't see. You can nev just never land on top of Peach. Yeah, just getting anywhere within Kui of her, you just get comboed pretty hard, but you can space her out the vast majority of the time. It sucks seeing Peach throw turnips here, though. Like, she just pulls him into oh. a stitch. He's gone. This is not working out for, uh, for St. Nick. <laughs> People don't see because they're not watching. Yeah, also factually true. It's bad, sure. All right. Looks like it's not going to go to time unless this <laughs> goes for two minutes. Well, no, they're uh, they're they're on time, they're uh, on track for time, right? Yeah. I mean, they could yeah. actually. They just need one slightly longer than average yeah. stock. And look at uh, like Nick's gun. Oh so no, yeah, no, no, they're actually like they're committing. Yeah, they're getting bored. But I'm gonna be real. He's 15 to 15. He could eat a lot of yeah he interactions should. out. He could fuck off. Yeah, he should run. He should run for a minute and a half. But running for a minute and a half is probably quite hard. Yeah. I mean, you can just like ledge camp for a bit. Should have prediction the match with timeout. Yeah, that would have been a good one. Get some sweet Kaiser channel points. Kai him. doesn't have any insane rewards, which is kind of like sad, because I have like 15k Kai bucks. <laughs> 15 Kai bucks? Yeah. <laughs> From Kaitopia. Oh uh, man. I wish I wish there was something really dumb. Like a spa day. Pick his outfit <laughs> for the next tournament. <laughs> Which is how he styles his hair for the next tournament. That's, oh, that just might be it. Yeah, he's used up he's dead. He's not coming back. Oh man, this is funny. <laughs> oh my god, what a game. Oh, the booze. Oh man. Imagine not going to time. This makes me so happy. I'm, I'm not... You're going dream lady. I'm yeah. not making me yeah. plus. <laughs> We're going, we're going, but, uh, I mean, McLeod did almost win. Uh, he's probably closer than he was game one on bats, so. <laughs> Again, yes, I love my <laughs> Uh, unfortunately for everyone, much like everything that happened in Fight Night, this is also Melee. Yeah. Oh, man. They're, they're, this is a lot faster, though, than it was before, at least. I think Nick realized he was winning. Uh, yeah, the interactions you win. Was in, you yeah. win a lot of them. If like if you approach Peach, it's kind of like Falcon. Weirdly, if you approach Peach on the horizontal, yeah, and just space backers, you win like fucking all the time. Unless she has a turn up, and then your stuff gets stuffed out. You get people like a dare and then. Was like I guess my point was that I think like when oh, Nick was trying to camp, he was losing to the turn ups. Yeah, and when he was going in, he wasn't winning like enough interactions to be positive. Yeah, the turn is really like this. And it's not like McLeod's gonna... 
he, like, this is not a very played matchup, so it's not like he's going to be able to power shield everything like Log does. Also, I think, free, um, so. I think, uh, McLeod does, does, like, at least think about this matchup a lot, because he's been preparing for Nick for a long time. Yeah. And he knows this is a real possibility. Like the final boss of SA. Yeah. Soon to be gone. This is Soon a lot to be gone, fun. yeah. He's going to be the new boss of SA. Mate. The head honcho here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Exactly as, soon as, I, as soon as I can ledge dash in tournament, you're all fucked. <laughs> I don't think I've ever played you before. I really need to hop back on the grind <laughs> for this sometime. It's a fun game. Muscat is SA new. <laughs> Bump the game timer up to 10 minutes? Nah, we need to make... <laughs> if you really want to stop it, you should like put it to 3 minutes or 4 minutes. But if you love Puff, you should like put it to 15 uh, or an hour. A sponge final is a Puff who, yeah. who loves this. Uh, there's just so much going on that uh, most people don't think about. That fucking forward smash is so strong. It was like, yeah, I mean, if this is Fox Peach, 40% is nothing, but in this matchup, this is, uh, has a lot of work for McLeod to make up. Yeah. He's just eating it, man. He's like going to the stop platform. Yosh, like, Musket is not SA Nick. If you made it 15 minutes and then, like, reduced the ledge grab limit by a bit, might might be pretty cool. As a spacey player, I don't see a game for the past three minutes unless I'm playing against a dog, so it doesn't really impact me. Yeah, that's a true combo, by the way. The, yeah, yeah, the it dare. is. When she gets put in the dumble, uh, tumble animation, if you L cancel up smash, she always gets hit by I'm told it's not that easy, though, to hit. It is fucking super hard to hit. Okay. It's really weird, because you have to hit certain frames of the down air, and then based on where she's hit, your L, uh, L cancel timing gets messed up. The reason, the reason I'm not sure is because the person who told me is a Puff player who thinks everything Puff does is hard. Puff is like... Her mechanics are really easy. It's just the uh, knowing where to do it and when to do it. It's hard. That's about it, though. Good at you're on thin ice. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh my god, he could have got a rest there. The big card has graduated from rollout to being good. Rollout's a fantastic move, man. I love whipping that out, like mid set. It's so bad. It's so bad. It like, when it hits though, they get sent flying. I think Jigglypuff's uh, forward smash is like, so underused though. It yep. is really, really good. The big card, going slightly bold at 12. Kind of unfortunate. <laughs> slightly bold at 12. Yeah. Another year older, another year bolder. Oh, there's the stitch. This could do a lot. The crowd did audibly cheer for the stitch. The stitch! Only you could hear the enthusiasm in this room. It's popping off. Genuinely the most emotion I've seen from these people all day. Yeah, people are losing their minds for better or for worse. Maybe it's just the matchup speaking. If, uh, I'd be really happy if McLeod won this, just so we could watch some more. <laughs> uh, I think we'd be seeing Yoshi's Moth. Or FD and Moth. Yeah. Or maybe Nick wants to be the third person in this room trying a, a sheep counter pick. Yeah. <laughs> like Peach. Yeah, I hope so. Alright. This is really, really close. Hey, make it gentlemen's back to Dreamland. This is a way faster game as well. This is more than a minute That's faster. True. Yeah. Think about how much faster it might be the next game. <laughs> this matchup is really sad because you can't really rest Peach that often. Like hit her with an up to like low percent. But if you do rest her, it's enormous. Yeah, right? it's huge. Like, she has to work so hard to make that work. Yeah. Yeah! <laughs> As I say, you can't <laughs> rest him. <laughs> Absolutely uh, brilliant. Wait, Congratulations. Nick, Nick dab Nick. or floss. <laughs> Absolutely. Hey! Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, you love to see it. He's. Uh, how do we go to, how do we change over to the Wait Nick, no 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 yet no yet <laughs> Absolutely elated. How do we go? Oh, Nick again, we didn't catch it. Thank you. Hey. Hey. Ooh. Yeah, we got it, we got it. Yeah, that's awesome. Uh Goody is pleased. He says thanks, Nick. You'll definitely get a sponsor that way. Alright. That's a fun tournament.
thank you everybody for watching. That uh, grand final set was uh, the best set all day. May I say, always enjoy this stuff. Uh, our viewer count actually went up a little bit at the end there. Yeah, they still they heard about the stitch. And yeah, they heard about the stitch face. For the rest, incredible. Yeah, left and dropped it on Twitter. Oh my god! <laughs> a stitch. Yeah. <laughs> McLeod SA pulled a stitch face. It's over. All right, thanks everybody for watching. Catch us later. Uh, who let this guy control the stream? Don't tell me. Wait, it's gone? Uh. Goody, that one was for you. Yeah, I would love for you to win his interview here. You know, that's the last South Australian local I'm going to win. Yeah, number one victory rail. Yeah, I'm coming to Vic. I'm going to be gaming up a storm over there. Love that. Got my cloud jumping on. Valiant effort. Grueling Dreamland matches. How does it feel being the champion once again? Let's say Nick. For maybe the last time in a South Australian local for a good while. A little, little bittersweet, I'm not going to lie. I'll miss you. Yeah, I'll, I'll, it's the end of an era for sure. Yeah. Say exact address. Uh, <laughs> I don't actually know the address. So. Well, the start of an exciting new era. Hell yeah. Hmm. Oh, man. What do you think of Puff Peach and Marth Peach? And I, why your dual main, explain your domain in general. Like your thought process I think behind on Dreamland. It's Marth Peach is such a hassle. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is obviously a hassle, but it's like a hassle for everyone. Yeah, sure. That makes sense. It's like when, like, what what other matchups do you do you like picking with Peach? I noticed you didn't pick it versus Mask Cat. Well, no, because I knew he would pick Fox. Oh, if you can't, like, oh, okay, because you have to pick first because yeah. you lost. Yeah, sure, sure, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I didn't really want to play Puff Fox yeah, until I'm a bit better at that matchup. Do you strictly do you do it player to player, or do you do it strictly based on matchup at this point? Uh, matchup usually. Like yeah. in America, I was doing it based on matchup. Yep. Yeah. Um, did you get it? Yeah. Good shit, dude. Yeah, I didn't know about the Muscat cheek actually. That was uh, yeah, kind of blindsided me a bit. Muscat, uh, he's been playing it a ton yeah. recently. Like um, when I play, go over to his house or have sessions at Evac. Like half his games are cheek, and I imagine Crazy. when he plays unranked, he always plays secondaries. And like I've just noticed it's gone a lot better recently. So he felt, I think it's a, uh, it's a lot better than what it showed. But I think it's the sort of point where it's like it's a secondary, and you're not used to tournament with a secondary yet. Yeah. So like it's just a different. It's just something where you you have to get that character used to tournament rather than just friendlies. That's true. You did a good job of uh, edge guarding oh, against you. Musket in particular. Yeah, I was I was relatively happy with that. <laughs> it was funny. Yeah, he won the last. So I, when I went over, we always play sets to the end of friendlies. He won, won the last cheek set. So I am uh, grateful that I didn't get owned in this one. But I did want to run back in the fox. Um, I was feeling good, but obviously yeah. Muscat thought he could win. So. I was talking to Coffee Respect on stream it. about the uh, losing the last set advantage. Yeah. Because when yeah. you lose the last yeah. set, you've got all the fresh ideas about what you need to change. When you yep. win the last set, you're like, I'm still the king. Yep. Yep. Don't I agree. need to change that. To change anything. Just keep doing what I'm doing. Yeah. I, I've always said that. Well, like <laughs> losing, winning sucks actually. <laughs> winning actually just stinks yeah, if you want to get better. Yeah. Losing is actually just nuts. Like, because when, when you have to, when you win, it's like you have to manage winning. When you're losing, it just does it for you. It's like, <laughs> yeah, exactly. But yeah, see, Goody, when we play Friendos, I'm doing you a favor. Yeah, just, the more you get owned, <laughs> the more mad you'll be, the more you're trying to fix it. So, yeah, yeah. Is there a Ryan here? Well, there a Ryan here. Badass. Damn. Well, this won't be the last. I'll see you in a week. Hopefully, I'll be able to, oh, yeah, be no able to have another one. We'll be in Kane. Com together in Melbourne. Com is going to be crazy. Com looked... I didn't realize... Like, I just like... Uh, Goody literally just was like, yo, do you want to come to Com? And I'm like, yeah, I guess if I can get housing, he's like, I'll house you. And I'm like, all right. And then I just find out it's like a one, 1K pride pot, full production. I was just thought I was just popping over for a local. And I'm like, you know, nice. It looks epic. I don't <laughs> know if it's... Uh, is it even announced? 
Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah, it was actually announced. That I had to keep yeah. it under wraps for a while. I had to lie to people. Yep, yep, yep. I had to say every day there's no calm on the twenty twenty fifth. Well, he said there was calm on the twenty fifth, but he didn't. He didn't. And he was literally just like, "That's it." There's no other details yet. A shout outs to Kalen. Kalen putting in the work. Phantom Love and Calm. I don't know. Love a new tournament series or a revamped old tournament mm. series. I'm Love the uh, the money, the production, <laughs> the hype. Yep. It just feels good. Osmaley feels good right now, honestly. Just keep it going. And then hopefully Phantom having the internationals. Maybe we can get someone get some Randy upset would be really cool. Yeah. That would be that would be sick. Nobody's beating J Mook. I'll say that much. Yeah, not from a <laughs> maybe if he goes That's Fox. That's a tough one. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. It should be a lot of fun. So I don't know. I'm happy with that tournament. I'm, like from from my perspective, that was probably the best tournament I've played since switching. So nice. only up from here. Yeah, good shit. Since switching to box or switching yeah, layout. Switching box in general. Yes. Like like cause I don't know. I think like I've won other sets, but I like I won. Other people like either played worse or I think just over. I think that was probably the best I played, even though Moscow beat me. So um, yeah, you were you were clean. You were moving fast yeah. in a lot of the matchups, especially against Sheik. You were crazy. Yeah, I felt I I, I don't know that matchups a lot of fun when you get to play it. Like I don't know. I've always I've always been a Sheik complainer because I'm just like man, I don't get to play this character. I'm, I'm it'd probably like it if I got to play it, and then like every, I got to play it like every day for two weeks, and I'm like, wait, this is sick. I like Sheik. This is cool. Mm, maybe that's my problem. I should have played it more. Yeah, you literally just played it. Like, it's. I feel like Sheik's this weird character. Like, Sheik is, has different rules to every other character. Like, I think it's just a character, like, at least from the Peach perspective, the, like, the big thing I had to learn is moving back is bad. Like, really bad in most spots, but moving forward is really good. So if you can get under the Sheik, it's not, like, from the Peach perspective, if you can get under the Sheik, it's, like, insane. And, like, moving forward, like, Sheik has to commit to something, like, pretty bad to hit you for moving forward. Whereas moving back, all she has to do is she just runs yeah, up and grabs you, or she jumps. I saw you really do a lot of sequences where you would just, like, run in, crouch, and, like, box with Nez. Yeah. And just, like, bully your way in, which was good. Yep. All right. And um, I guess we can finish up. Well-watched cool. stream. Thank you. Thanks for the, the Moki Bondon raid, whatever that was. That was Love sick. That. Get 600 people on some SA Melee. Yeah. All right, right catch up. Alright folks, thank you for watching, much appreciated for coming by, uh, loved having everyone here, thank you for coming through to another, um, another Cheese League, always, always appreciated. Thank you for everyone who followed earlier today, yeah, really love all the support, thank you for Bundan for hyping everyone up at Orb and then sending them over to me. That was really, really nice. Um, as always, guys, you can follow all the happenings in South Australia. Um, yes, we will complete the bracket. Thank you. Um, ah. Oh, no. What happened there? Why did we lose... Wait. Ah, oh, it's because I pressed the wrong button. There. Wait. No? There we go. Hey, what's up? Um, do we need to finish the bracket? Hey. Let's see. Yeah, so yeah, thank you, Bundan, for hyping everyone up in uh, Orb and hosting me immediately afterwards. That was really nice. Oh, we have, we're have we so far behind in the bracket. That's so funny. We will finish this right now. McLeod Coffee Rex was 3-0, wasn't it? It was 3-1 between me and McLeod. Uh, guys, what was the score between Nick and Muska? I think it was the 3-0. 
And what was the score between Musket and McLeod? I actually don't know. Someone has to fill me in there. What was what was the McLeod Musket game? I need someone to tell me. Actually, um, yeah. So please, please follow my Twitter if you don't already. Follow Catchphrase I say on Twitter. Uh, check out the vods. They'll be uploaded to SA Smash TV. Um, they should be up, you know, within a month, hopefully. Um, Always have a good time coming out and streaming these events, uh, and it's things like following the channel that really, really help me. And if you're watching this on YouTube, please like the video, because that's always nice as well. Alright guys, I'm Dunzo. Yeah, I need someone to tell me. Hey Musket, what was the score between you and McLeod? Alright, thank you. Hype. Flood the stars. Um, and then it was 3-0. Nick McLeod. There you go. Finish the bracket. Thanks, folks. Yeah, thanks for watching, everyone. Really nice having you here. Uh, now we got to go host you off to someone else. Um, we have to go host someone. Guys, we have to go host someone. We have to host someone. Um, let's see. All right, guys. Oh, wait, no, that's a real one. I'm not, I'm not doing that. Um... Hmm, what do we, where do we want to go, guys? Where do we want to go? You know what? I'm hosting Daisy. I'm, I'm raiding Daisy. They are... I think they're still doing a subathon, actually. Yeah, they are. Go give, go give your local Adelaidean cat girl some money. Alright, everyone, I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. I'm peacing out. Thank you for stopping by, everyone. Love you lots. See you next time. Bye.